is very big. And I want you guys to do the same thing in your life. When I talk about shaking poverty and why I go all out like this to teach you guys and do all these things, it's because of, I want you guys to do the same things in your families. Some of you are stuck in jobs. You are working a job, a nine to five. You are tired. Even now, this session, you are tired. You are watching me, but if you are sleeping, because of, it was very long, long day. Just stuck in traffic. Some of you are also going home, only going home now. So guys, this is a trap. There's a, a trap that we're into right now in the economy. But for now, I won't touch onto that. Uh, we'll talk about it on the second chapter. And when I talk about the traps of the economy, people want to go deep. I'll expose the economic system and why people are, are stuck in this trap. So guys, forex trading is one of the ways that we can go out of this uh, poverty mentality or this debt. And uh, as time goes, I will not only teach you forex. There are some secrets that I also have besides forex. I'm talking about as time goes, I'll also, also teach you about cryptocurrency. I'll teach you about equities, how to, how to invest in shares so that you don't always trade every day. Money is coming in each and every single day. You get paid in dividends. Hey. So uh, as time goes, we change the uh, curriculum, it will change the knowledge. But for now, let's make money in a, in, a, in a platform that we all are familiar with, which is trading. So guys, thank you so much for joining us, uh, uh, joining me today. Uh, I'm not alone, I'm with another gentleman called Mr. Venom. As I said, th this is a two-day uh, class. Today, we are going deeper into another section, intermediate today. Actually, it's intermediate today, but it's also a little bit advanced. It's fine. It depends on where you are in the market. Are you advanced? Are you intermediate? Are you? It's up to you. But um, there's another gentleman called Mr. Venom. I, that guy is dangerous. Uh, there are people. So me, as I made it in trading and made it in trading and made it in trading, uh, of course, people came to me in numbers uh, asking me that, uh, hey man, can you teach us how to trade? Some people came to me and showing me that they know how to trade. So for the past five years, six years, I've met some crazy people, some very good people in the market. Some of them, they're coming from my own hands. Some of them, they knew how to trade, but I, 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 I adjusted their psychology and then they became much better. So uh, this gentleman who's with us today, Mr. Venon, uh, he's one of the good traders as well uh, in my team. In my team, I've got about six guys. I've got Venon, I've got Benedict, I've got uh, Stores, I've got another guy, Mr. Pido, dangerous guys, I've got Mr. Bosi, I've got Mr. Bafana, I've got Mr. Cedric, Mr. Mosam, King of Well. So uh, these are dangerous people who are all trading with different styles, different styles that can accommodate everyone. But today I invited one guy, which is Mr. Venon. That guy is dangerous. Right? There is an Asian session. Right? There is a London session. S London session. So, uh, many people, um, they just jump on the market any time of the day. That's something. No, 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 and no, 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 and no, 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 and no. Uh, you need to comply with the rules of this pairs. That this pairs will be most volatile and will be most profitable during one of these sessions. So, uh, with my experience, I realized that two sessions here are the most important. London session and the New York session. So, a uh, London session in South Africa is 9 to 5 p.m. You see, the New York session in South Africa is about uh, around 2, about 2.30 to 30, I think because of the something called daylight time savings. That is means that now you can see if you check uh, Nasdaq, the market open opens at half past four. So uh, even NFP is going to change the time now. Uh, so you will see that the time now is going to be changed. So uh, it's called daylight time saving. So it can be around 3.30 p.m. this one from there. But you can see that they overlap these two. Sometimes they're together at the same time. And uh, not sometimes, they always are overlapping. Then we have the Sydney session and the Asian session. As Asian session, is we use it for fundamentals. If you remember, uh, we used to kill fundamentals, then we stopped. Uh, uh, trading fundamentals. So why? It's because of uh, uh, COVID came in and the market now was quiet. Hey, hey, hey. COVID also when it came in fundamentals. But I'm talking about the ones of 2 a.m., 3 a.m. We never used to sleep as a matter of fact. You find the NZD once 11, 11.45 p.m. Uh, you find the AUD once 3.30 a.m. Just clear our thing. But if you want to depend on it, of course, sometimes the news comes like Obama. Not Obama. Yeah, Obama. Yeah, because I've been trading even during the times of Obama. Obama would come, just come one day in. Oh, good people. I just want to say today that um, we have postponed the NFP. Uh, there's going to be a meeting at the at this. Uh, ay, 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 ay. That thing mentioned. Yeah, yeah, people are angry or the. So, of course, Robert does not know there's Obama talking. He doesn't care about Obama. Yeah, 
I blow the account, that is when, of course, so almost will never work in fundamental. So you want to monitor. So people just want to let it run alone. They are high. It won't happen. So guys, it works. It's proven. So the market will always just do uh, something like this. Uh, the market, it will come down. It's trending down. Right? People are excited. It's selling, right? And then it goes up. When it goes up, uh, you find that some people already are sitting there, just you don't know some of them what they're doing. Because some people are panicking. Hey, what's happening? Ah, then before you know it, uh, it comes. Let me just do this. Before you know it, it comes down again. Ah, the sellers are excited again. No, we're still in. Ooh. Hey, before you know it, it comes back here again. Hey, what's happening now? Before you know it, uh, 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 you are waiting now. This is what is called a neckline. This part. Uh, this part is what is called, what it says, neckline. So we want to see what's happening now. Sometimes I see this when I'm about to give a signal. I wake up in the morning. Whoa, I see, oh, okay, to you. What's happening? I see the market is going down. And because of me, I'm very patient. I don't just jump very quickly. I see the market is going down. I just wait a little bit. I'm waiting, I'm, I'm sitting here, I'm just sitting, I'm sitting, I'm sitting, I'm sitting, mm. I'm sitting. Mm. Hey, as I'm watching, it goes up. So I want to see if, if it's retracing. As time goes, or tomorrow I'll teach you about Fibonacci. So you can know that, okay, is this, this a FIB? A FIB, it means, is this a retracement? Is it giving us a chance to sell more? And some, some people do really sell more. Ah, they don't want to add more. <laughs> I've got my friend, whenever the market goes opposite, he's adding more, and I've seen some of you guys doing that. No, you don't do that. You wait a little bit on to see what's happening here. Yeah. What's happening? And if you're already inside, it's sad. But if you're outside, it's so nice. That's why patience pays. Uh, so you are waiting, you're waiting, you're waiting. It comes here, it comes down again. Even here, I'm not excited. Uh, even here, I wait a little bit. So it comes down again. The minute it goes up and it comes back to this level where it was, me, I don't even waste time. Already, I take my phone, you just check my phone. I say, guys, it's time now. I even go there to Telegram, though it is over 30,000 people where I know that day I must come with a lot of perfection. <laughs> oh, I there I see now it's time. I already know why. It is created what is called a double auto. So the market goes down, it's moving down, goes up, goes down. Then this part here, this part here, uh, this part here, this part here, this part here, one and two, it's called a double bottom. It was there, went up, came back again, meaning it's fetching people. So uh, the price will always fetch some people, some people that it wants to fetch first. So you'll find that, remember now, before we go, guys, before we go into Practical. Let us understand the theory. That is why I said to you, let us go and people like to say, right for next talk about the philosophical side of things. It's a must come up philosophy in trading. So you understand who is buying. It's not just a game of buying and selling. There's so many things. Forex exchange is serious. Foreign exchange is serious. So uh, these people, they are a syndicate. They are a group of guys. They can be me and Beno like this, but it's more people. More people, they are in all over the place. Absa in South Africa was it went through this thing. Let me just show you. Maybe you think I'm joking. Uh, let me just show you. Okay, guys. Um, the, the pair that I'm currently on right now is GBP USD. So uh, I just want to give you guys a quick rundown on how to identify your your trends, right? On how to identify your trends. So on the four-hour time frame, uh, I like to use a four-hour time frame because it allows me to use multiple time frame analysis. So once I start on my four hour time frame, I will then drop down to lower time frames such as one hour as well as uh, the 15 minute charts in order to get entries. So in order for us to narrow down our entry points, what let me just show you a quick example on NASDAQ. There was a trade on NASDAQ. Right, so over here, this is our zone, right? So we have 
our right uh, left shoulder sorry the left shoulder we have the head and as you can see we have the right shoulder so this one was for the sow so instead of the pattern looking like the one we drew on GBP USD, this one over here, it is in the opposite now for the cell side. So basically what you're going to do is once you have seen this part of your market structure playing out, right? You will then highlight your zone, right? You highlight your zone and then once we get a break back below this level, this is what will now give me confidence that this trade should be forming the pattern for the QML level that we are looking for. So this area is where we will be taking our trade, right? So as you can see over here, I have marked it out already. We have our zone, which starts off with the left shoulder. It creates a new high of which is the head of the head and shoulders. It drops back below the level. So once it drops back below the level, this is where we will now expect a retracement back towards this significant level over here. So inside this level, as you can see, we have some rejections. So these spikes over here are letting me know that the level is actually holding and that it is possible that it is valid for an entry. This here. Oh yeah. When this part, when I see this part is coming back here, I, that's our buy signal now. Buy now! Go all out. Go all out. All right. <laughs> I stop. Yeah. And then we go. Boom, boom, boom. It's already moving. So it will always come and test there. So that is what we call the FTP now. Uh, is, it in the, is it safe in the case of avoiding FTR by putting a buy stop? That is what we do. Mm -hmm. We are waiting. Yeah. We don't want to just jump in, especially me alone. When I give you the buy stop, I'm already in. But I want to accommodate everyone because people sometimes when I say buy now, I'm saying profit. No, I, I, I haven't bought yet. Yo, which number? You see, so now they don't know what's happening. So I know buy stop, we're all going to be in. Exactly. That's all. Yeah. So when I buy now, you find someone buying. When I say buy now, that's also no. Buy now. You'll buy here already. And I saw it here. Mm. Buy now. Mm. I don't know what. 30 minutes later. Okay, say so I'm in now. Must we hold? I say, ah, oh, we are going in when we leave now. Mm. So when the professionals leave, the amateurs come in. Hey, you know what guys, no, 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 it's too much for the day. Tomorrow we've got more. Two hours in, three hours in, and no, data is kind. Please, good people, uh, let me uh, say I'm going to release you for now, because tomorrow is another class again. I just want to hear people, uh, just give me your comments, just say whatever. I'm, I'm, mute, I'm, I'm, I'm unmuting you now. You are unmuting. Shaya, Shaya. Uh, Shaya, can I please start with the... Shaya, 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 thank you so much for the help. Thank you. 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 Thank you. you. Instant. Someone wrote thank you. Wow, wonderful. <laughs> Chapa, I'm out, guys. Uh, power, power, power. No, that's wonderful. That's wonderful. Thank you uh, so much for joining me today. Uh, today is actually a very special day uh, because of uh, it's a day where we have what is called a full moon. Uh, so it's a very, very powerful spiritual day. Uh, those people who follow uh, my videos, I teach about hidden wisdom, I talk about spirituality. Uh, this is one of the biggest days. So after the class, I'm going to be going out tonight uh, to my meditation uh, center and going to meditate. So it's a very powerful day today. 
I'm hoping that all of you can find blessings and in your trading and in everything that you um, touch. Uh, so uh, you, you, you are very fortunate to be talking to me on a day like this today, because normally full moon, I realized later that, yo, this is my first time ever in 10 years that I'm, 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 I'm just, you know, discussing other things besides spirituality or I'm not in prayer for now on a full moon. And normally I'm, I'm very quiet on today. I just go to uh, one of the mountains or I just go somewhere, just meditate. As you know, most of uh, my, my background is uh, spirituality, meditation and everything. So you are talking to someone uh, who is uh, spiritually uh, ascended and who's awake and he's teaching you today trading i feel like it's a big blessing for you so you really have to be uh, proud of that so um uh, let's continue with that and then uh, let's see what is going to happen and how you guys can can, can, can see yourself moving forward because me i believe that each and every single thing in the material world in order for us to see maximum success we need to have a, a lot of spiritual awakening so today when i'm teaching you this information i definitely uh, know that you are going to be excelling so hey let's see what's going to happen i don't know i don't know i don't know i don't know uh, let's see what's going to happen so uh, um, I, I see all of you on my on my but let me just show you uh, i've got uh, my screen here where i can see all of you here uh, i see everyone here. yes beautiful beautiful guys here some of you are working and one of you are working and uh, you need to be seated and you must also have a, a, a note a note note pen yeah, because of this is serious uh, you can't just say i'll memorize but luckily i'm going to upload the videos and then i'm going to put them for you on a, on a secret link on your talk so that you can just re recite them so uh, let's continue uh, let's go forward and let's see what is happening today let me uh, see what we have here uh, the market, let me tell you something you don't know now. The market is formed by natural patterns that are derived from human behavior. Wherever there's a human being, if it's a robot, maybe a software, then I'll say I don't know if it can work on gold. But if there's going to be market participation by human behavior, human beings, then human beings, what they normally do as they breathe in, and breathe out, they will do the same thing on the market. They will take profit, they will close. They will... So the market is a complete reflection of the human being. This is human anatomy. Hey, hey, hey. Ay, 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 ay. Ooh, ooh. So this square here, let's take this square quickly. Let's take this square. Now we're closing, we're, we're, we're closing the day. You will tell me if you want me to come back. Say, Dr. Wade, we want you to, to teach. Uh, me, actually, there was a time where I stopped teaching. I I was called to come back. Um, I actually retired, you know. He was there when I retired. I'm with my guy, my friend. He was there when I retired. Which year did I retire? 2016. I retired in 2016. Me, trading, teaching, I retired. But people called me. They said, come back. So I'm back now. So you'll call me now after this video. Say no, come. We still want you to teach more. <laughs> yeah, you see, I, I, I'm closing it now. I, mm, let's take this. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Mm. You see, mm -hmm. this is more than what you can ever get anywhere else. This guy he says, ah, don't worry. People, people will show you. Leonardo, powerful guy. He showed you how to buy or how to sell at a cheaper price at a discount. Now let me show you the future. And he says each and every single in the in the, everything in the market, whether it's a stock market or it's in the forex market, the market will always move in a cyclical pattern. And he says that you see right now when it's like this, I'm sure for you it's confusing. You don't know what's happening. You just say 5651, you don't know what's happening here. You don't know what's happening here. So let's go, let's go and explain it. So, so in trading, this guy, this is him, who's not me, who's talking. This guy, he took ten dollars. He made it hundred dollars, hundred dollars, thousand dollars, thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars, hundred thousand dollars. There was a millionaire from zero, 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 from that vision that he saw. We saw the square, and he said that the square is powerful. It talks about the future of the market. So, by the way, I was able to use this square to even predict other stuff besides forex. I've used something similar to the square. I don't know if Venom knows. I predicted that 
the the rebox, the spring box. Yeah. That the the rugby that they will win. Before yeah, that they was uh, a year or two ago. Two ago, not two years ago. I predicted. So I can even predict other stuff besides the market. So I predicted that the spring box. Uh, rugby, rugby, they're going to win. Before they even went to the final, using cyclic cycles, I saw that every 10 years, I saw with the, with the cycles, I think even... Oh. Well, let me just unmute you. Yeah, <laughs> 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 <laughs>